What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Joseph Sakura, a.k.a. Tommy Egan from Power, Book 4, Force. When Gary Lennon and the other writers and I were mapping out our third season, we saw that we were telling a complete story and that this was the perfect opportunity to stay true to our artistic vision and make this the final chapter in Tommy's journey in Chicago. But don't worry, Tommy's journey is far from over with. We're just getting warmed up and I can't wait to show you what we have planned next. Want to give a big shout out to all the players, the cast, the crew from Power Book 4 Force and tell you to tune in because ghosts never die and power never ends. So that was some unexpected news that I don't think a lot of people thought would happen anytime soon. And I certainly wasn't expecting to get that tonight. So this is effectively an announcement that Power Force is canceled. That's what this is. But let's talk a little bit about why this is happening in particular. So if you guys would recall, a couple of months ago, Gary Lennon, who is uh, the executive producer on Power Force uh, at the moment, uh, and he also used to also produce on the OG Power as well, he recently signed a new deal um, with Stars to go ahead and produce new power shows. And so what we're seeing right now is usually when you get into the fourth season of a show, based on a number of different guild rules and requirements, typically your salary is supposed to go up. Now, if you guys remember the video I did a while ago where Lionsgate and Stars are splitting ways and then Stars is really gonna focus more on building out more and more power shows because they realize that's their main base. But because they're separated from Lionsgate, that means that that funding is no longer there the way it was before. And so we're gonna see a number of these cuts happen, but they're gonna make strategic moves to create new shows. But one of the key things he said here was, of course, power at never ends and ghosts never die. Now, of course, they say that to get us excited and intrigued and whatnot, but I'm thinking a number of ways in which this can play out. And of course, I want to hear you guys' thoughts in the comments as well. First thing is, Ghosts Never Die is a thing that they are also saying a lot within this current season of Power Book 2 Ghosts that people like Michael Rainey Jr. has said on The Breakfast Club and other interviews, right? So my thinking is that behind the scenes, maybe they're saying that reinforcing this, to now emphasize the meaning of ghosts within the power universe as we know it might become something else, or it might mean ghosts didn't die, right? Come on, there's only one of two ways in which that can make sense at this stage. And also I think that he's going to show up more than likely as a voiceover, he being Joseph Shakura in Power Origins, which is the young Ghost and Tommy spinoff that was announced as well, whereas he will be, um, voicing over older Tommy and hopefully Omari comes back and voices older Ghost. But also this could mean that Gary Lennon is also going to be executive producing a new spin-off of Power focused on the current timeline maybe set in a different place. So maybe that's Tommy and Tariq um, or Tommy and Ghost, who knows, uh, at some point uh, in the current timeline. But also, unfortunately, if that plays out like that, that also means that they are sort of, in some ways, giving away of Tariq might survive this current season uh, of Ghost, which I didn't really think um, wasn't going to happen. Uh, I thought that he, of course, was going to survive it because it wouldn't make any sense to take him out. I, I'm just speculating he might end up uh, in prison. But I'm can be certainly wrong on that but there we have it guys um power book four force canceled season three is going to be the final season they're going to develop some new show afterwards um maybe still with him in it who knows what it's going to be at this stage but man um that's uh, that's unfortunate i definitely want to hear what you guys have to think about this in the comments how do you feel what do you think is next what do you think he meant by ghosts never die like come on like let's talk about it in the comments and if you received any value in me putting out this video talking about this feel free to like comment and subscribe would appreciate it and if you also want to know what my projection of the power universe timeline was be sure to check out the video on the screen until next time peace guys